Legoland today. Um, if you don't know, in Florida, as a teacher, you can get a teacher's card for Legoland, SeaWorld, and like a few other parks. So I'm actually here to pick up my teacher's card before I'm not going to be a teacher anymore. So let's go play in Legoland a little bit. It closes in a few hours. And let's get my teacher's card. Look how cute this hotel is behind me. I'm going to stay there one day. It's actually really cool. So before this was Legoland, if you don't know, this was called Cypress Gardens. And Cypress Gardens was actually one of the original amusement parks in America. And so Legoland took over the property, but some of the gardens still exist. I really want to see them. So let's go. Hey friends, I just got into Legoland and they actually have been doing no mask outside pretty much since they reopened, which is really interesting that the other parks just started when they knew it the whole time. But I got my teacher's card and I bought it. I so it was good for one year, which is different than SeaWorld. It's really interesting to me how all these parks work. So I got my teacher's card with Water Park, Madame Tucson, and Sea Life Orlando. And the and I paid $59 extra for that stuff, but I'm really excited. It does not cover parking, but I didn't pay for parking today, which is really cool. I'm gonna put my sunglasses up because I can see for now. And they gave me like this really cool complimentary brick. It says 10th celebration birthday. So I'm really excited to be in Legoland. I'm really excited. Like I said, I haven't been on this property since I was a little girl and I've never been to Legoland. So let's go check it out. Woo, woo. Do you see these wait times? Like, holy moly. This is what dreams are made of because y'all know every other park is crowded. Hey friends, okay, so I'm outside this like famous granny apple fritters. Let's go see what they're all about before we go check out a ride in the garden. I'm super excited. Hey friends, okay, so I got the goods. Oh, this echoes. I got the goods. Let's see if I'll focus on them. Mm. Anywho, I forgot my camera stand, so it is what it is. So I put this on my bag. I don't know if this is a safe idea or not. But these are their famous apple fritter fries. I got it with whipped cream. So we're gonna try with whipped cream first because I'm obsessed with whipped cream. These taste so, so good. Let's try them by themselves. They could be hotter and they probably be better. I'm not gonna lie, these are cold. Maybe they're supposed to be cold, I don't know. I want them popped up, they'd be so good. Okay, the guy offered me caramel. I'm not really a big caramel fan. I don't know if I'm gonna like it. We're gonna try it anyway with only 50 cents extra. By the way, I paid like five something for this. Dude, Legoland prices, wait times have amazed me already. And we're gonna have even got that far. Definitely check out Legoland. Look at that, caramel. Hmm, I'm not sure. Honestly, I don't see much of a difference. Maybe because I'm not putting enough caramel. Let's try one more time. Okay, do you see that? We're gonna do a lot now. That's a big negative on my book. I don't like it. I didn't think so. This whipped cream. So Legoland closes at five on the weekday and six on the weekends. I'm one happy camper right now. I forgot a book. This would be perfect with a book. So honestly, I've eaten half of them and I'm kind of over it. I'm kind of over the apple taste. Honestly, I just don't think I'm into apples and fruit that much. Um, it's literally straight up apples that they like fry and dust. So I don't know, I'm over it. We're gonna go find some other park treats because these prices are amazing. Um, can someone like book me a hotel stay at Legoland? If you're watching this, sponsor me. I wanna go to Legoland Hotel. Holy moly, do you see this? $16 for pizza and pasta, all you can eat? Are you sure we're at a theme park? I'm confused, like what in the world? That is so good. This is so cool, the poor building here. Do you see this? I'm literally in shock how much I'm already in love with this park. Like, I might be going back here a lot more, y'all. 
because it's only 40 minutes from my house and that's not bad at all and this park is so cute let's go try to find a ride to ride come on i see one already i want to ride look at this This is gonna be my first ride. It's so cute. It's one of those like ones that go back and forth. I'm gonna put my stuff down. They have like little cubbies right here. So you just put your stuff down and then you hop on. Review on this ride that I just rode. I don't even know what it's called. Something Mia. I don't know. We're near the Heart Lake shopping mall. That's what it goes into when you're done. It was very spinny. I thought I was gonna black out at the end of it because it was so spinny, but I really enjoyed it because I really like spinny rides, honestly. If I was that kid that would spin around, so I almost blacked out as a kid. But I'm already obsessed over this park and loving it. So let's go see what else we can do. Friends, okay, so I'm gonna do the Lost Kingdom Adventure next. So we have five minute wait. I think this is the one where like you shoot things in it. And then this is the same the same company that made this one. Also made Blue, Bla Blue Blasters at King's Dominion. I'm not 100% sure. I'll let you know when I'm done with it. Let's go find out. Let's go. Birds, spiders, aim at the targets on the arch and set them fight. You must stop Sam Sinister and save the treasure. Look everywhere. That was exactly what the ride I thought it was. It is the same company that makes Blue Blaster at King's Dominion. And they make another one, I can't think of where, makes this one. And this one was harder than Boo Blaster at King's Dominion, I will say that. So that is my honest opinion and review. Hey friends, okay, so this roller coaster is only a five minute wait. So we're gonna go do it. Let's see what it's all about, the wooden roller coaster. They used to do this when this was Cyber Garden. But now it's Legoland and they still do ski shows. They still have the ski shows. But first, mate. I came for Cypress Gardens, the gardens. Like I said, they still exist here, the gardens. So let's go check them out. Again, like I said earlier, this is actually Cypress Gardens, what it was used to be here. And it's actually very historical because it was one of the oldest amusement parks in America before Legoland took over. So let's go check out these gorgeous gardens that I remember as a child. And I'm so excited to be back, I can like cry. I'm just not over, like right behind me is the, you could probably get a little closer, but is the historical gazebo. Like I have flashbacks of this park. Like I remember this beautiful area and like, I just can't believe it still exists. Like thank goodness Legoland kept it because it is absolutely gorgeous. I'm definitely coming back with a book and just sitting here for the day. It's beautiful back here, it's shady, like, I am in love with Legoland and I'm just blown away by the hour I've been here. So what has been going on, how cheap the prices are, how short the ride, the rides are, these beautiful gardens still exist. Like they still have the ski show. I'm telling you that ski show has been here forever. That was part of the ski show. I don't know what it is. I'm not watching it. Um, but it's just crazy. Like. My parents, you guys wonder like why I love amusement parks, why I love traveling. One thing my parents gave me as a child is vacations. Even though they could never afford it and like it was a struggle, they always found a way to take me somewhere. And they used to take me to a lot of amusement parks and a lot of different places in Florida because that's where I grew up. And like, I just, you know, it's crazy as an adult, like that's as much, I still love it just as much as I did as a kid and that will never change. And I'm just excited that I can take you guys with me to all these parks and all over Florida. So if you guys wanna see more, please subscribe, please check out the more videos and give me some recommendations where you want me to go next. I am totally down for day adventures, weekend adventures. Like I wanna show you guys the world. So come on, let's do it together. I'm just so happy, like I just feel so blessed right now. All right, friends, that's it for today. I'm tired, I'm worn out, and if they sell a park pass for Magic Kingdom later, probably won't go. Look how cool, you could stay here and like literally just walk across to the hotel. Definitely recommend it. Have, have a good day, sending lots of love and lots of good vibes. I don't see you all later.